What's up guys, it is the Assassin 320 here, and I'm here with a video, an updated video on how to get Fraps uh, 3.4.7 for free. Um, I did a video on this already, but uh, it was really crappy. Uh, so here's just a really quick uh, updated video. Uh, so yeah, uh, you want to download this from the description. It's, uh, um, it'll take you to a media fire page, and you download it from there. Uh, then once you download it, drag it to your desktop or something. Uh, and also, I'm not using Fraps for this obviously. I uninstalled it and downloaded Bandicam uh, just for the purpose of this one video and I'm probably going to uninstall it after. Uh, and just stick to Fraps because that's the main program that I always use for recording. Uh, then what you want to do is um, uh, right click on it and click Extract to Fraps 3.7.3.4.7. Then you'll get this folder, then uh, this folder you don't need it anymore, then just drag it to there. Uh, and then you're going to open this, and then uh, uh, it'll have that, you want to double click on it. And um, mine, will, mine automatically um, will uh, um, run it as administrator, it, I don't, I'm not sure if it's for everyone, uh, but if it doesn't, you want to right click and run as administrator. Okay, and then this will come up, uh, then you want to hit I agree, hit next, uh, hit install, and there you go, you hit close, and then um, you'll have this on your desktop here, the fraps icon, but then after you turn off the, your computer or and then turn back on, there's going to be a bunch of files on, there's about like 6 or 7 files. Uh, that will be on your desktop um, that's the really only thing that I don't like about it uh, there's gonna be another fraps um, thingy there's and there's gonna be a few other files um, so yeah uh, that's kind of a um, what I don't like about it it's not just this one icon um, but it's still good um, they're like it'll say fraps.dll or something uh, something like that after you turn off your computer uh, so then you can just uh, double click on it, hit OK. And here is Fraps uh, FPS, um, your movie. Uh, go to movies, that's basically which one, uh, what you want. And Fraps thingy is just that shows your FPS. Um, and yeah. Uh, and then you go to, uh, I like checking FPS, I'm not really sure what it does, I set this to that, go to movies and you can set your uh, hotkey overlay, I mean, your hotkey, I hit uh, control Z, uh, and then you can set your FPS, what you like, I usually always record at 7, uh, I like changing it to half size, um, and here uh, you can record from external input like a microphone or something, um, record window sound uh, that'll be like the sounds from your computer and stuff um, multi-channel that's for like Skype calls or something like if you're doing some video with your friend who's on Skype um, if you do multi-channel you can hear that but yeah um, and then for screenshots you can set your overlay uh, format J JPEG PNG BMP TGA and whatnot and you can set your um, uh, theme above where you want your videos to save um, and yeah uh, so that's all what Fraps is um, and you, if you don't know how Fraps really runs then um, uh, you can you can check out the all my videos actually are uh, mainly using Fraps uh, so uh, that was it guys uh, thanks for watching and catch you guys in the next